A boat crash that happened on the Connecticut River in Portland. One man lost his life and seven other people were hurt last night. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Aaron Edwards is learning more right now about the victim. She is live for us tonight in Portland. Aaron. Aaron and Mark, we know the victim was a man in his 60s from Waterford. Seven others were injured and taken to the hospital. And today, four people remain in the hospital, including a six-year-old boy. I'm just surprised because I come down here quite a bit. And last night was no different. Al Peel came down to the river, but he didn't have his usual calm view of the water. Instead, it was filled with first responders. I saw the boat sitting over there when they were investigating. Tonight, we're learning the man who died was 60-year-old Wayne Hamler from Waterford. The Department of Energy and Environmental Protection says four others are still in the hospital, including a woman in critical condition and a six-year-old in serious but stable condition. They tell us two others, a man and a woman, are also in the hospital and stable at this time. It's hard to believe that somebody died and all those people got injured. It's really hard to, like, grasp right now. This all happened around 5 o'clock yesterday. Investigators say that's when they got several 911 calls about a boat crash. DEEP says the 21-foot jet boat was traveling north when it veered to the shore and crashed into rocks. Those on board were ejected. We saw the aftermath of it. We drove by it after, and it just it's such an eerie feeling. Jillian Plumer has been boating on the river for five years. She was brought to tears talking about the tragic crash. It honestly, sorry, it breaks my heart because we have two little kids too, and it's just a freak accident and something, you know, you never know. And con police are asking anyone who may have witnessed the crash to call them. Live in Portland, Aaron Edwards, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.